soft velocity. Let's talk about um, Nginx. Eventually, you will have to run your application using a server farm, or you will have to run um, several systems accessing the same database or the same follower and the same application. And you will have to do something called load balancing. When a request is incoming, the load balancer will see what server is got the the less connections is less busy, and then it will redirect the request to that, to that specific server. This will offer you many, many advantages over a traditional approach. Uh, for example, you will be able to have several servers running the same application. You will not have to worry about the number of clients connecting to the to the system because you can have several servers running the same app and the load balancer will do everything in, and will never overload a single app broker. Let's see how it works. I have Nginx here. I'm going to run it. For example, on my servers I am going to connect this Nginx to localhost. Let's verify that. Yes, it is localhost. And that broker is running there. Now, um, I have many, many options. But basically, this version of Nginx will do everything for you will create the proper uh, configuration file. Everything will be done by the system. And let's start Nginx. Also, you will have a um, couple graphs. One of the graphs will let you know how many connections you have at the same time. And the other one is uh, you will be able to tell you the top connections based on time. Now, instead of connecting to the same port, I'm going to use the port that I define here. If you see the configuration file, I'm using a different port. Let's use the same session. It doesn't matter, it will work. As you can see, it worked just fine. If I go through the program, if I go around, you will see that everything is working properly. And if I go to the graph, you will see that I have three connections. Three connections per every copy of the program at the same time. You may ask yourself, what about performance? Will it make it slower? The answer is no, it will not be slower. It is going to be in some time, sometimes it's going to be faster. Why? Well, because with um, Nginx, I am using compression. If you have a very narrow link, you will be able to take advantage of the compression. Because instead of sending everything uncompressed and using the whole bandwidth, uh, you will be using just a small subset of that bandwidth because everything will be compressed and decompressed on the fly by the browser. That's a great advantage. With this approach, you can have as many servers as you want. If you want to add uh, 30 servers, it doesn't matter. It will work and Nginx will be able to balance the load among those servers, making your administration efforts 
well, it's going to be less effort and more productivity. That's the advantage of having Nginx combined with a broker. Of course, you can change anything you want. If you need to modify the, this is a test configuration file. You don't have to do anything else. It will do everything for you. But if you want to change anything, you can do it. And also you can have it running on the background. It will never take too many resources. It will be, it is very, very slim. Very nifty. Also, you can see here the log file. You don't have to go around just checking what happened with the connections. And on top of that, and on top of that, you can have as many configurations that you want. You can load a proven configuration or save a new configuration that you modified. You can run as many tests as you want because you can change as many parameters as you want, create a new configuration file, and then test it against the other configuration file. It's uh, very amazing to have um, Nginx for AppRock.